Hi, this is Nitin Chandra and in this video, I will show you how to create CSS3 gradients without writing any code. Ok, let's get started. Open your browser. Let's hit google.com. Okay. So let's type for CSS3 gradient generators. The first the first link on your uh, Google Google page is Ultimate CSS Gradient Generator from Colorzilla. Let's in, let's hit on it. Yeah. Once you land up in colorzilla.com, you'll find uh, you'll land up in Ultimate CSS3 gradient generators, where you can find like uh, there are many predefined uh, co co color gradients already already available available for you, where you can find a glossy gradient, uh, glossy different colors of the gradients, and it's a linear gradient, uh, transparent gradient, yeah, many uh, different uh, different kind of gradients are already predefined and it's available for you to use directly. Okay, so uh, the, you you find a pre uh, preview pane right hand side on your uh, on your screen. Uh, so let's uh, let's create a custom custom gradient for you. We'll select a, a linear gradient where you can find like a blue flat uh, like hash two, and you want to change the color of uh, color of this uh, this gradient. Okay, let's hit the checkpoint of this one. You'll find a color picker for here. Similar to the Photoshop Photoshop color picker, you can you can change the colors over here and get the colors which which color you want. Maybe like you can uh, you can select uh, different different gradients here also. We'll select like a one one gradient uh, using color picker. Yeah, I'll select this color. Okay, we'll check another another. Another checkpoint. Double click on this, and you'll find a uh, you'll find another same similar kind of color picker which you visualized before. You can, if you want, you can add a hexadecimal color 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 code here, or else you can just drag and drop whichever color you need it. I'll just drag and drop for now. Yeah. Yeah. This color this color gradient looks pretty good. Fine. Uh, but I don't want this uh, uh, this color gradient to be like a diagonal thing I just I, I want a orientation to be a linear gradient I'll just make it like vertical thing okay yeah uh, you can change the orientation here like horizontal uh, vertical diagonal upside di di diagonal down 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 upside or else radial radial gradient anything if you want to change the color or uh, to uh, you can reverse the color by just uh, just pressing the reverse button here yeah but this doesn't look good. Uh, but this is this is pretty good. Yeah. Or else you can change the hue saturation adjustments here uh, in adjustments uh, section. Like you can change the uh, color color over here and uh, get the preview also here. You don't want uh, this to be done. You just need to just cancel the things and it, it will it will be there how we want it. I'll take uh, vertical vertical gradient which is suitable for many of the uh, button. Uh, button designs or a banner design or something like that. Uh, yeah, you can uh, if you are working on SAS or something like you can ch just switch or uh, switch to SAS code also. You can you will get all the all the code in SAS, which you don't don't need to write from scratch. We'll we'll use uh, CSS for now. Fine. So this this color format is in RGBA, where uh, it's using like red, green, blue, and alpha. But I don't want the RGBA color. I just want a hexadecimal color to be needed, so that uh, in the future, if you want to change the color, also okay, it, it's it's easy to change the color in hexadecimal. Okay, so it created like it created a hexadecimal color code for uh, CSS3 for all the all the browsers, maybe like WebKit gradient uh, for um, uh, Chrome, um, Opera, and uh, Microsoft uh, Microsoft uh, Internet Explorer. Um, yeah, Internet Explorer IE8, IE6 to IE9. There is a compat. There is uh, it. It uh, it has worked for uh, backward compatibility also. 
so you don't need to write uh, any separate code for any of the any of the browsers nature of the code is written for all the browsers so this is pretty easy right yeah just copy the code which is uh, which is generated by the color code color generator um, fine we'll open a dream vivo where uh, i've created a html html5 document i have linked the master.css document to this okay there is a css document here i'll just create a class called uh, gradient dot gradient I'll just copy paste all what we have copied to clipboard the way, the way we have created a CSS, CSS3 generator in, in CSS3 generator. I'll just save it. I'm creating a banner with a gradient. So uh, it will be of 100% width. And height of uh, 300, 400 pixels. Okay. Yeah, I'll just save it. I'll call this gradient class over in HTML HTML5 document div class gradient. Yeah. We'll visualize this uh, this page in browser and Chrome browser. Yeah. See, you can find a gradient generated from CSS3 color, color gradient generator, and you don't have to write any of the code from scratch. Major of the code is written and it works in all the browsers. That's pretty easy, right? And you can save, the, you, you like this gradient and you can save this gradient over here so that when, whenever you come back to, uh, whenever you come back to the colorzilla.com again, you'll, uh, you'll find the gradient which you have, which you have created and uh, you can directly use it and you can change the colors based on, uh, based on your requirement. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, major of the part is done, I think. So you can, you can, uh, you can check this in uh, browsers like uh, Firefox, uh, Firefox, Chrome, IE and works it works in all the, all the browsers so you don't have to be worrying about the browser compatibility too yeah that's it thank you for watching this video you may subscribe to my channel to more uh, to more about me visit www.nitinchandrasa.com thank you